For the first time since January, Bitcoin, the world's most popular digital coin, briefly dropped below $30,000, a key level that technical analysts monitor. It erased its gains for 2021 before recovering to trade at $32,481.93, according to CoinGecko, a crypto market data site. Bitcoin at one point shed more than 10% to trade as low as $29,154.73, losing more than half its value since hitting a record high in April. That's after a tremendous performance in 2020, with the digital currency surging more than 300%. Other cryptos joined the sell-off before pairing losses, with Ethereum, the second biggest digital currency by market value, slumping more than 5%. Now it's ticked up 0.7% over the past 24 hours. The selling also spilled over to smaller coins like Dogecoin, a meme-inspired crypto that at one point tumbled more than 25% to erase all of its gains since April. It has since cut declines and is down 1% in the past day. Why are cryptos falling? After topping $64,000 in April, Bitcoin has struggled to reclaim its all-time highs since then following a series of events. It came under pressure in May after tech billionaire Elon Musk, who has driven traders into frenzies by mentioning cryptos at times, said Tesla will stop using Bitcoin as a form of payment over concerns of the cryptocurrency's impact on fossil fuels. Since then, cryptos have gyrated as coins such as Ethereum typically to move in tandem with Bitcoin. In early June, Bitcoin fell further amid concerns of its use in the colonial pipeline ransomware attack. Bitcoin for instance, briefly touched $40,000 last week and fell again Monday after China's central bank deepened a crackdown on cryptocurrencies. China's central bank said it ordered some banks and payment firms, including China Construction Bank and Alipay, to crack down further on cryptocurrency trading. Bitcoin shed more than 10% on Monday, its largest one-day drop in over a month. How much have Bitcoin, Ethereum and Dogecoin lost in value? With Tuesday's losses, Bitcoin has slid more than 50% from its all-time high above $64,000 in mid-April. To be sure, Bitcoin is still up more than 200% over the past 12 months. Ethereum has shed nearly 57% from its all-time high of $4,356.99 in May while Dogecoin has shed more than 70% since it touched a record of about 73 cents last month, according to CoinGecko is more pain to come. Cryptos could be poised for further declines based on a closely watched indicator, according to technical analysts. Over the weekend, Bitcoin formed a death cross, a chart pattern that signals the potential for a major sell-off. Bitcoin's average price over the past 50 days fell below its 200-day moving average, which means there could be more pressure on the digital coin. Long-term Bitcoin bulls are getting nervous as a break of $30,000 could see a tremendous amount of momentum selling. Edward Moya, senior market analyst at Foreign Exchange Trading Service OANDA, said in a recent note. Many traders have waited for one more push lower, which could see crypto traders wait for a plunge towards the $20,000-$25,000 area.